Welcome back, Math Wizards. Today we're going to learn how to estimate quotients, but this time we're going to have two-digit divisors. So when you're estimating problems, boys and girls, you need to figure out um, an answer that's close to the actual answer, but most of the work needs to be done in your head. For this, we need to round our divisor, which is 78. We need to round that to the tens place. So 78 will round up to 80. And so now we need to look at our 8 and our tens place of our divisor and say, what number is close to uh, 230 but divisible by 8? Or 232 but divisible by 8. And this problem is easiest just to look at that 23 part and figure out what number is close to 23 but divisible by 8. And then just change the back end of the number to zeros. So what number is close to 23 but divisible by 8? Well, 8 times uh, 3 is 24. So let's change that 23 part to 24 and then make this 240. So 240 is compatible with 80, and now we can do some simple mental division. So here we have 24 divided by 8, and that equals 3. Let's cross off our zeros in our divisor first, just like the division patterns video. And then since we cross off one zero in our divisor, we're allowed to cross off one zero in our dividend. And therefore, there's no zeros left to put on the end of your quotient, so your uh, answer for 240 divided by 80 is 3. Because of that, boys and girls, the estimated answer for 232 divided by 78 is about 3. And we have our estimated quotient. It's very important to just think of numbers that are compatible and be able to start to do these problems in your head. Thank you for watching my video on estimating quotients with two-digit divisors. Please look at my other videos for other math help.